Let's pray together, may we? Yes. Father, your word says, if your people who are called by your name will humble themselves and pray and yes. seek your face, you will forgive their sins and heal their land. Father, I thank you that we have a president, President Donald Trump, who believes in the power of prayer. We thank you for a vice president like Vice President Pence who works alongside of him. And we thank you that the president had the wisdom to call our nation right now for a day of prayer this coming yes. weekend, Father. This is what we need. We pray for healing for our country. Yes. We pray for physical healing for those who have suffered the devastation from Hurricane Harvey. Father, be with them, provide for their needs. Help us to be the embodiment of Jesus Christ as yes. we minister to them. But Father, we also want to pray for spiritual healing, emotional healing for our country. This country has been bitterly divided for decades upon decades, and now you have given us a gift President Donald Trump, who wants to bring healing to this country, and he is bringing healing to this country, and I pray that you would give him and Vice President Pence the wisdom they need to truly make our country the country you want us to be. We want America to be great again, and we can know that America can only be great if as America is good, and we know we have a president who wants to make America good. I pray your blessing upon him, the First Lady, their family. Give them wisdom as they seek to honor you. And we pray this in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, who came and died and rose again, that we might have eternal life. It's in his name that we pray. Amen. 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 That's beautiful. Thank you very Thank much. You so much. Thank you so much. I greet everybody in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. I really thank God because uh, God has given good opportunity. I want to tell something because of Donald Trump. He is an ex-president uh, United States. And he is a very good short temple. <laughs> and uh, also he invited some false prophets in White House and they, pro they prayed for Donald Trump. You have seen that video. But Trump is a danger of more than coronavirus. Trump is a danger more than coronavirus. If he could be elected as a president second time, he would have killed off of the world by third war. Therefore, God did not choose him again as a president. He was fallen. But who is called that false prophets and they came into White House and they prayed for Donald Trump. And Trump had believed strongly again he is going to become next president. He confirmed himself again he is a president. But who is called that false prophets and they came and they prayed for him because that false uh, prophets they don't have salvation. Even they, they, they don't understand the Bible but the Bible says there is one church. If they pray, God cannot listen every prayer because of those who are saved, those who are entered into the body of Christ, if they pray, God will listen. No, if they don't enter into the body of Christ, if they pray, God will not listen and he cannot listen because of one person doesn't have salvation. But he has been praying since yes. Can God listen? No. Without salvation, if you pray years, or you, if you pray months, but God will not listen. Therefore, Trump has invited the false prophets, the prophets uh, enter into White House and prayed for Trump, and Trump was fallen. Therefore, he could not become again president. In case if, if he could be president, he would have killed off of the world by third war. He would have brought third war. He would have destroyed the world by third war. Because of Trump is a short temper. 
he has a strong mind he has narrow mind and also he has carnal mind therefore god did not elect him as a president so my beloved brothers how trump was fallen is a very good short temper but the bible says he doesn't have patience i have seen some uh, videos in fox channel and abc news channel and if they ask any uh, yeah, if they ask any one question donald trump and uh, again suddenly he shout and he rebukes and he says uh, he gives strongly warning that a journalist was afraid afraid because i have seen some videos who is called that a journalist was afraid because of uh, donald trump and he shout and he rebuked him so he is because of donald trump doesn't have patience he needs much patience so if if he doesn't have patience and he cannot be elected as a president in the old covenant uh, we see there are so many kings they could rule very well even trump uh, people believe or not i don't think is a good person bad person i don't think he might have good character or bad character i don't think but what what can i speak he is a very good short temper and he invited false prophets into white white house and they prayed for trump trump was fallen he did not he god did not choose him as a president thank you so much for watching god bless you